I just wanted to touch on sort of what the dynamic was like sort of working with your brothers in a band. I mean, I think it was shortly uh, shortly after um, Octopus that Phil left the band. Um, I just wanted to know what, what it was sort of like. Were, were there many arguments or did you feel a little more comfortable saying things that you wouldn't have said to uh, friends? <laughs> oh, look, you know, certainly with me and Phil. Uh, Phil left the band. Obviously, Phil left the band, as you said, after Octopus. You know, and and, um, and he had, um, you know, and he had his priority uh, was his family. He was the only one married at that point. Right. Um, he had a he had a, two kids or three kids, um, and um, it was very difficult for him, you know, uh, to go on the road for months on end, and not be with his family. Uh, we, you know, so, you know, he he would be very um, tense. Um, understandably so. You know, on reflection, this it's uh, it's something where you, when you, when you go through it, you you understand. It. You know, having like a, two older adult kid, adult kids myself. Um, but yes, when he when he was we were in the band, he would. He is, that's why he left the band basically because he wanted to be with his family right. and rightly so. Uh, during but however, you're asking about the dynamics between brothers in a band. Um, yeah, it, it, it's always the same way. There were, it's usually two brothers. We had three brothers in the band. <laughs> um, so really, uh, and this went even back as far back as the Simon Dupree era, Phil and myself would be at each other's throats 24-7. Right. Um, <laughs> to be honest with you. Uh, at, you know, and it, it was a dynamic that if you didn't know, if you weren't on the inside and you didn't know that we were brothers and loved each other, People were, would be shit scared that we're going to beat each other up, right. you know. Uh, you know, but but it, but it was it, that chemistry, and, and Ray was always a peacemaker, if you like. Uh, but and, and and the other members of the band would stay away, uh, you know, hoping that you know we wouldn't be in uh, you know in a in a, in a sort of a punch up, if you like. But uh, we never were. It was always a dynamic that Phil was the elder brother, um, and uh, I think he felt that he should be the the guy leading the band, and I was the lead singer. So being the lead singer, and, and I felt, I'm, I'm the lead guy. You know, so well, what are you talking about? So it was almost like the lions, you know, the lion pack, if you like, and, the, and the, I'm the younger lion trying to take over, and the older lion saying, well, fuck you, I'm the, I'm the guy that's in charge. So that was a dynamic that continued all the way through uh, until Phil left, of course, and that was a, it was a, ter- it was a really bizarre occasion for us because it, it was a, you know, even though, you know, that was a, it was tough for us as a band when Phil left because we had started together in, in, in years ago. Um, so we had to revamp and rethink. Uh, but when he left, it kind of left us in a situation where we thought, well, what the hell do we do now? Um, but we continued. And I think we flourished, actually, in, in, his, in our way. Right. Um, but he, and he flourished, too, because he had his family and, and, yeah, yeah. and he's got grandkids and he's even got great-grandkids, so... It's great for him, you know, and we're in touch all the time. Mm. 